Hello, this is Oggy with XGodRC, and I wanted to show you guys a new product we have, the sensor for the new gassers from OS. OS uses a rotation sensor. It's called the GT33, this one here. These things are installed at the engine itself. And in the front of the engine, they use this here, which is a dry washer, which is this one here. I put it on a Moto tool, you know, Dremel equivalent, uh, Rory tool, so that we can actually simulate an engine rotating, okay? So the problem is that these uh, sensors are not compatible with the receiver RPM sensors, because this sensor is connected to the uh, ignition control unit of the OS Max. So the problem is, okay, so how do we go from here into our flavorless system or receiver system or anywhere that you need to measure RPM when you're using this type of uh, sensors? Well, most people are actually adding additional magnets and things like that. So uh, this is the one that everybody wanted, which is converting the signal from the original um, OS uh, sensor the GT33 uh, sensor, okay? And uh, so what we do is we convert it, we take the signal from that and send it to the um, ignition control system, okay? So it goes like a, like a loop over here and continues to the control system. But this side and this side, these two sides are actually completely isolated from each other. So as far as the sensor is concerned, you just had a, uh, an extension, you know, like putting a servo extension, you know. So the IEC the, and the ignition control does not see any difference, okay? But what happens is that between these two, this one here senses what's going on on this side. This side here has electronics that senses that. And not only that, also um, powers and, and, and um adjusts so that the sensor is actually working. As many people can know, you cannot plug the sensor directly into a sensor sport because it will not work. So this one has that feature that it, it will activate and, and make this thing usable. And at the same time, uh, it acts like an extension for the for the in, in ignition control box, and uh, which is the one that makes the spark, just in case you didn't know. That's, that's why you need the sensor here. It, it's just for timing for the spark. Now on this side here, it has a sensor, it senses what's going on on this side. And then this one is here generates the exact system pulses that we need. So this one has two ports, the bottom one and the top one. The top one is for the Neos and icons and all of the other things that are not Futaba. The bottom one is for the Futaba stuff. So. Uh, as you can see, I have a Neo here, and that is connected to the top, okay? So that's what I'm going to do right now. Let me plug it to the top. I'm going to power up the um, Evo control here, the V control, okay? And I'm going to go ahead and turn on power, okay? So we have it, and there is an RPM sensor here, as you can see. And what this will do is I'm going to turn it on now. And here I am. See, it's already measuring uh, RPMs. So this actually is in the in the engine. This is at the exact spot. And here's the output shaft, you know, from the engine. And this is measuring the position of the uh, crankshaft to time for the sparks. So this here right now is going through this and as an extension goes to the uh, IC, the, in, the um, ignition controller. And uh, at the same time, this side here, this right side, uh, senses what's going on here and generates the actual correct pulse. Now for the, for the Futaba, and I'm not, I'm sorry, I don't know <laughs> how to do much Futaba stuff, but I just know that I can plug it in. Okay, let me plug it in. Okay, here, probably, yeah. Okay, so I plug it in the bottom, okay? 
And now we have Futaba, I'm using a CGY 760, okay? And um, I believe it's on this one here, telemetry, yeah. RPM sensor. Okay, so this one has a different ratio. I think it's a 10 to 1, so it's going to have 100 or something like that. So let me turn it on. See, it's immediately sensing for Futaba. Okay, so that's uh, it. So this is the unit. Okay, and it's uh, available. And like I said, this is the sensor side. This is the IC side, which is the ignition controller. The top is the non Futaba stuff, like Neos and icons and spirits and things like that. And the bottom side, like it is connected here last, is the Futaba stuff. So that's it. That's the way it works. So hope you guys like this thing. Uh, don't forget to click on the uh, subscribe button and also on the bell so you can get all the notifications on whenever we uh, upload stuff. So this is available and it's going to be in the escartrc.com store uh, for you guys to to get it. You know, now there's uh, going to be the full craze of the new small gassers.